And now the third type of request you're going to receive from employees is shift change requests. So when an employee logs in, they have a little button on each publish, publish shift that says offer up and they can choose to offer up that employee either to another specific employee if they've already had a conversation with them or they can offer it up to the same uh, server role or whatever role that they're trying to get rid of and it will only notify employees that are capable of working that role that there's a shift available for grabs. So the employees are still let known, however, that the shift is theirs until at least one employee bids on it and the manager approves it. So you can see here, Ben wants to take an open shift and I'll show you open shifts on the schedule once I get there, but open shifts are something that you can create and publish as a manager or as an admin and allow employees to be able to bid on it. So if you had a really busy Saturday coming up because you had a large party reservation and you just need an extra bartender uh, to cover and you don't care who it is, you just want an extra body, you can release that shift and employees are able to bid on it. All of the bartenders would receive a notification and they'd be able to bid on it in hopes of getting it. So you can see here that he's a bartender and you can choose to assign or deny. In this case, Ben wants to work for Aurora you can assign or deny as well. Where two people want to work for Aurora, they come in order of who bid first. So Ben here bid first, Brian was second. However, you'll see here that this conflicts with a shift that Ben already has. Another warning you'll receive in this area is if this employee is about to go into overtime by accepting this shift, or if it conflicts with a current shift as you see here. If you have some of the advanced labor settings, then it will also give you some of those for uh, the California or New York jurisdictions. Once you assign or deny, it will automatically change on the schedule.